Hello and welcome back to Old World. Now in between episodes, welcome back to episode 2, so it's only the second now. I looked into the um, map modes we in fact have here available, which are more like information map modes, which I don't recall using when I played it after release, or either they were not, all of them were there. So basically what you can do is shift click, for example, we can turn on the income which we have here on these tiles, but also we can, for example, turn on the resources which are available here. Can you have more than one on? No, apparently hold to toggle lock. Wait a second. I'm confused. Maybe there's a way to turn on more than one. Anyway, we have, for example, the roadmap mode, which is in, or like trade not trade net node and city connection tra uh, map mode. It's going to be interesting, for example, to see how could to connect the cities. For example, we the rivers tiles would be connected here if we were to settle there, and stuff like that. And at the end, we want to connect into a trade network, which costs gives us a lot of bonuses in the end too. You can also turn on promotions here to see that this one got the fierce and the combat promotion. But for the moment, most interesting is this map mo most likely just to see better where resources are. Alternatively, the yield map mode to see like how efficient our tiles are. As we can see here now, the double effect of the two farms is producing a lot of growth, food and stuff like that. Now, let's get back to the game. We have to do a turn. Yeah, we can't do anything with him. And we want to clear out this barbarian camp. And okay, big questions. After a visit to an ascetic retreat, our daughter Prince Neferu returns to the palace moved by her experiences. She wonders about the role of humanity in the greater cosmos, unsure if a person should question their place or submit to a higher authority. Okay, now she's asking us what our opinion is. So we could get some science and she would get some experience. She could get pious or superstitious, but we cannot make her intelligent, proud or inspiring. And in fact, I want to take the science and the experience on her. And now she is finished, in fact. And we want to make her... Yeah, we want to make her a scholar. Okay. Um, apparently... Yes, we are falling in love with someone. Uh, do we want to have a lover? Um... No, it's fine. Let's just play it out. Okay. Sobek Nerfur of Asset has come before you as a representative of the Said family, asking that you control three specials. Okay, now we come to the ambitions, in fact. Now we can select two ambitions or experience. Uh, if you fulfill an ambition, you also get legitimacy from it and experience, I think. Now we ambitions complete six festivals, control three special uh, control three specialists is easy for us because we already got one and we are going to build more. Therefore we are going with this one which is an easy first one. Now uh, we didn't get to culture the next culture level yet then we can use the um, to speed up production in fact. And now the question really is what do we want to do? We could either continue and build it in some of the farmers here or we can build another military unit. However, I would like to... Yeah, we cannot speed it up yet. In fact, I would like to buy it out as soon as we can. For example, with the civics here. Now, we have the next... Um... Yeah, the next city site is up here. Therefore, we could go into the next settler for turns and let's do it. In fact, we are going to skip for the 
relics here, uh, like this uh, ancient site for the moment, and we are going to. Oh, that's the bad news. We found Assyria, and we are going to keep the truth. Yeah, they took it already. That's really bad for us. And I'm not sure if we want to push him out of that. Hmm. But it's our second city side. We should have. We can only clear barbarians here and clear barbarians here. So basically, they stole one city slot from us. And their capital is up here. Therefore, it's not going to be anytime soon that they can settle it. Therefore, let's heal up, move up here, and probably defeat that scout there. Even though we might regret our choice later on. Okay, we built three farms and we maybe should move down to the marble already. Or, no, in fact, we finished administration. Uh, I think it was because of the event and therefore we skipped some kind of pop-up. Let's see. Um, here we go. Yeah, we had discovered administration. Now the big question is what do we need next? We have the selection of four four technologies here. Let's go for drama to start the music. That means that we can in fact go here and build the granary to get even more adjacency effects. Plus, plus 0 0.1 and plus 1.8 growth. Therefore a total of three plus the two it produces itself. Therefore plus five growth from one building, pushing us from 23.7 to 28 or more. It's going to be very, very useful. Okay. And how strong is that scout in fact? Three health, three defense, 20 HP. Yeah, that's fine. Let's end the turn and oh, he moved forward. Nice. Okay, uh, Tutmosis comes to you during a rare break from Academy seeking guidance. Two opposing factions of thought dominate my discussion. <clears throat> One holds that the fates direct the way of mankind, so we must accept all events with stoic tranquility. The other states that the gods are indifferent, fickle, and thus we should look to ourselves for enrichment of the mind and body. Tutmosis sighs heavily, which of these is the right way? Okay, now <laughs> this time we can at least give an answer and we are not too stupid to understand it. We could all either go into the path of making him fear God or making him more into money and knowledge. Let's in fact go that path here. Now, the, 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 uh, how they're called, Assyria in fact abandoned the city site, therefore we are going to take it for ourselves and we can move our warrior back, heal up and then continue working on the barb camp here. Now, we still have a lot of things left to do. We can select, okay, we can select a tutor. We are going to use our trader here because that's the only court here we currently have. Can you do, okay, what is intercession doing? Um, and now we don't want to do that. Oh, I didn't know that this would, let's redo it. So what can you do here? Influence, via queen, influence exerted, expose a weakness, influence succession weakened. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know exactly what it does, so therefore let's just try it out. And now we have four orders left, but we don't have any units left to work with. Which is a little bit annoying, but it's due to the fact that we can't make one currently. Okay, our Duke, second, second child, 
became educated. Very good. Nice. And he's still in education, therefore that's really, really good. Because he now has two wisdom already. Okay, let's go back to hunting barbarians, in fact. This one is still damaged, therefore let's get rid of it. And then we can take over the site and remove the rest of the barbarians here. Okay, now we have eight orders left. There's really nothing we can do because I don't want to move the scout up here because I'm afraid that they would steal my side and I probably have to accept the losses here which feels rather inefficient <laughs> because it is um, okay influence ah, it increases opinion okay so now he likes us even more which is okay Okay, the Duke Tutmosis has completed his study of politics. Now what do we want him to make? He could be an orator, which would give him a lot of a thing which gives civics, or a diplomat. Hmm. He's not going to be our leader later on. I maybe want him as a governor for the city. Plus two orders with city with friendly friendly family. Let's go with an orator in fact. Okay now the the granary has finished and we are now at 28.7 growth. Really really good. And the question now is do we want to build another one here to unlock the mountains to get some quarries placed there and probably that's what we want therefore let's go for it after the settler and down here the next worker has finished and we are going to hmm is there anything more important than the marble probably not let's start here as you can see, the marble is going to give us civics income, but also stone income, and that's really, really useful. There we go. Now, the other worker here, that's a big question what we want to do. We could build another farm here, however, that would only give us food, I think. Yeah, it would. However, we would improve if we were to do it. Can we? Can we just? Yeah, we would see that the the other adjacent farm would get a little bit more of growth, which is decent. But the question is, is it worth it? Probably not. We rather want to get the other marbles up and running as soon as possible. And now with our fighter here. <clears throat> we are going to work on the barbarians before they spawn in a new unit. Okay, we're not going to do the interaction again. Now, our warrior is going to get damaged quite heavily here, but that's fine. And let's end the turn. Okay, our daughter has Reflect on her recent experience and absorb many important lessons. She gained one wisdom. Nice. And he got even more charisma. It's really, really good. And now we are going to take out this side. And we might have to run back to heal. But let's see. Maybe we can survive, in fact. Now, Settler is finished and we are going to take this side first here. And then we are going to make another farmer and then we are going back into a Settler to plant down the fourth city. Now, our other worker here is going for this one. And build a quarry there. There we go. And turn.
Okay, now we have to check him out here again. We only have 5 HP left and we lost like 3. Hmm. It's going to be risky. In fact, I'm going to move back here. Oh, we can't. Can't get into the territory. Okay, we have to go here and then we are going to do force march to get here and then heal up. He's probably retaking the city side now. However, that's okay. And we are going here. And you are... Now the big question is where do we want to settle here? Do we need to take the recommended side? And we don't see... Maybe... Yeah, we should have done it differently. We are going here. Do we see anything? No. In this case, we just go here, settle it down. And now the big question is which one, which one do we want to settle? And I'm favoring a religious city here. Could also do a religious city down here. Hmm. Hmm. Big question here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's get a religion. Okay, and there was not nothing special up here. We got a lot of crabs, which is going to produce a lot of growth for that city. Would have been a good potential spot for another. No, probably not because we don't have a lot of tiles to work with so an urbanized city with like religion is probably a good idea and we are going in fact immediately for a zoroastrian disciple which we just founded and afterwards into a worker and then problem probably a forum but we can skip that for the moment okay and now we are ah yes Born from the ancient fire cult, Zoroastrianism has taken hold in Thornis, which is the holy city now. The teaching of the prophet Zoroaster has been passed down from generation to generation and now becoming a regular part of life in the city. They describe a cosmic struggle, the divine Ahura Master fighting against the chaotic Angra Manyu. Those who live with the ideals of truth, just and humility give aid to Ahura Master in his fight. Okay, how do we want to support it? We could build Places of worship, therefore increase the opinion of the religion in our state. We could just get some civics from it, or we could just refuse to ad adjust to a new religion. In fact, we are going to offer stones here because I want that religion established in our state as soon as possible. And now we have to go to the next turn. Dishonest and greedy. Prince Neferu is now corrupt. That's not good. Extremely not good because as a leader, every city has plus 20 money upkeep costs. Okay, next event. One of our agents in the Tutmos household reports that a prisoner is being held secretly in the family dungeon. The captive is an ambassador from Assyria who encounter overzealous Tutmosid guards on the road to the capital. They subdued him and are holding him as a spy. We should expect to receive an anger message from Assyria any day now. Okay. I have faith in the judgment of Tutmosid. Free this man and return him to Assyria. Yeah, let's infiltrate Assyria. Let's see what we can find out. Personal religion. Mm. The Austrian Magi of Thonis said that support of my master will only strengthen your rule and offer to teach you about the race. Will you accept? Yes, exactly. That's what we want. And we got another event, legal reforms. Vaset has recently re experienced a rash of blood feuds between individual families and I and I will soon make the whole city blind. A new code of justice must be drafted or violence in Vaset will devolve into complete chaos. 
Hauscher gekörbtes Alarming Vice in Vendettas. We could get a free law, which is legal code, which is going to produce a lot of unrest, but also growth of the city. Or we can get a forum for free and get a decrease in unrest. Mm. Let's check out the... Which one was it? Legal code? Here. Interesting. It requires citizenship. Where is citizenship? I got the feeling that that's very far down the tech tree. Citizenship, citizenship. I don't see it. Where are you? Jurisprudence, fiscal policy. That's the end of the tech tree. Scholarship. Am I blind? Ah, there it is. Up here. Something we definitely want to get relatively early, but it's gonna be far away. So maybe... Maybe we want to take it. Free, le free law, legal code. Is it getting enacted? Let's see. Yeah, it's getting in there. Nice. We got a free law. Upkeep order 0 0.6 orders. That's fine. We are swimming in orders currently. Not going to be for long though. And also the big question is do we want to enact one of the other things. Here we would get some money. Politism. And here we would get some orders. However, we don't have a state religion yet. Let's just, yeah, we can. In fact, I don't want to spend my orders yet due to the fact that I want to speed up stuff. She is currently, yeah, we cannot use money or something like that to speed it up. We can only use orders and I definitely want to save up my orders to speed up some projects which we require to and uh, need to be done. Okay, uh, let's take the next marble here. And as we can see here now, we got already up to 12 order income. Therefore, we are going to build a, sip, a forum afterwards, which is going to increase our income by plus one even further. Okay, and the military unit, we are going to heal once again, and then we are going to check out the city site again. Okay, and the scout. In fact, before we head to the south, let's find out what is up here. And we found an ancient ruin, really lucky and good here. Volooming trees towers over the dusty ruins, providing ample shade. Their branches are heavily, heavy with ripe fruit. A natural orchid stretches for miles. How will you use this excellent source of food? We can either get to around a 10 fruit, we could chop down the trees, or we could get some culture from it. That's a big question here now. 95 fruit is nice, but we got plenty of forests. Therefore, let's take the culture, which is going to be more useful for the moment. And it looks like there is a path pass into the mountains up there. Okay, we got another event. A mathematician from Vesit come before the court to present a recent breakthrough. They suspect that this is important work may have many value applications. Okay, we got a culture event now, which means we leveled up to developing culture and therefore can now speed up things. Could get 140 signs or a court scholar. Whew. 140 science is basically one technology for free. Yeah, I want that. There. We immediately finished the technology we currently had and now we can... Could get a free worker. Only cost us 40. We're going to do that. Yeah. 
Okay. And I'm not sure what did we research? We researched drama, yeah, because we have music now. Or we should get music now. Yes. Finally, music. And I think that's it for the turn. Let's finish it and make a cut in the episode. Because now we got music and it's going to be interesting how we want to continue. Because we can still waste our signs into a lot of things here. We could get f si uh, stones for free, we could get new technologies, but we are going to make this decision in the next episode. See you then. Leave a like and subscribe.